I'm Saranj. I'm Naveen. We are Chennai NFC. And we are the champions. We were pretty confident going into the playoffs because you know we were higher ranked. So as decided, Naveen was playing Ashwin and I was playing Tikka. Earlier in the league, we tried different things and it worked out well. I don't know why we changed honestly, but we did. I He's playing well and you know he takes the lead and, but concedes right after. So after that I I play Tikka. He does like he manages the game pretty well and like we end up losing. It is 2-0. But again, like we remember there was loser bracket and you know there's another chance. That's the beauty of esports, I think, double elimination. You know, Mumbai is one of the strongest co-op teams in the tournament. I think the strongest. But they end up dominating us in co-op. We somehow take it and like we equalize and all. But I think they were too good on that day. And they beat us like as a straight uh, whitewash. So after that, we're playing East Bengal, which is the first ranked team in the league. I went to the game with Ankit. Like he's. You know, he's a very unorthodox player, sort of. He scores incredible goals like finesse shots, chip shots and whatnot. So I go into the game thinking that I have to defend that and somehow if I get a goal, then that's in. Like that was my game plan. But it ended up being a KG game. I got a goal towards the end and then luckily I defended it out and we got the win in the first game. Finally, the full time whistle blowing off and Saran Jain breathes a sigh of relief. And then it was Naveen versus Shantan. And you oh. can see a lovely bit of skill and banged in. What a screamer there from Naveen. Like in the winner bracket game, he concedes right after taking the lead. And I'm thinking that, no, not again. But Naveen showing his composure and his experience scores in the 90th minute in the last second of the game. Be a very good break for Naveen. Oh. He goes through, fights it over. Oh. Does get that gap and yes. So we end up facing FC Goa. We have like a 15, 30 minute break, not too long. You know, it's a tough tie. It's like a mouth-watering match to watch. Oh, big opportunity for Saranj. And he has taken it. The green time finish. Saranj was playing well, but it was a like back and forth game. And again, he scored. And then uh, same way for Chennai NFC, he had to equalize. And after that, it went to Pens. Generally, I've lost a lot of games in Pens before. So I'm not very confident going into penalties. For right one in. Oh. And this time, he succeeds. And that's it, like we get the first win. And then Naveen is playing Wunsch. Now Wunsch is very experienced, so I tell Naveen that, you know, like there's going to be a very stronger press and a stronger attack coming in, so you have to be careful. And he does hold out and then he gets another goal and that's when I know that, you know, it's guaranteed and we're going to the grand finals. When we were about to play the finals, I was before going to the match itself, I was like confident, I don't know how. Something motivated me and I wanted to take that revenge on Mumbai because after losing to them, it's like it's basically Chennai versus Mumbai always a rivalry. The match against Ashwin and Saranj was like he was playing very confident and he, same way we took the lead. So it's 2-2 and after that, after it went to extra time, I was thinking it's gonna go to penalties because. I thought like, okay, we'll somehow clutch it up, but unfortunately we were not able to capitalize on that and we had to go with the loss in the finals. I was thinking about nothing about the loss and all. I, all I had to do was like play my game because if I win one game, it's it's tie. It, it, it is just co-op. We weren't playing uh, CR7, which is Cristiano. We decided to bench him and play Cruyff instead of him. And even he was skeptical, he's like, are you sure, do you, do you want to do that? I said, yeah, let's go for it. And he does, and the game starts out, we're playing well, and you know, we get the first goal, and guess who scores? It's Cruyff. After the loss, like in the first game, he was playing so well, because we had to like do, do it in the, this match, or it's nothing. And I, I don't think they were able to handle that pressure and we were able to capitalize on it. Uh, they started rushing out, they started making a lot of mistakes which they don't generally do. We just needed that one chance and we got that chance again and uh, after 2-0 it's like, I could feel it. I could feel, okay, we are winning it, we are winning it.
months, all the effort we have put, it is for this one day. Like there was a lot of emotions going through my mind and you know I was just happy, really happy for Naveen because that guy clutched when like it mattered the most, even though I couldn't and he still did it under pressure as well. So when we first started out, Naveen and I, we weren't obviously thinking about playing each other. And then suddenly, once the game's done, that thought hits me that, you know what, I might actually have to play this guy tomorrow. And after a moment, my mind started changing, like, okay, like, whoever goes, it's for the nation. Like, it was like that for me, like, okay, if I win, I'll represent the nation and he'll be happy about that. And if he represents India, I'll be happy about that, so. Even with that, we're just really happy for each other. Like even Naveen winning MVP and we doing well in the ISL, it's just, it's just a cherry on top of the cake. Getting that breakthrough, making sure, gets that easy pass in, 2 or 9 and scoring it all, 77 minutes. You know, even for Chennai, like those guys have been really supportive, even the club, the fans, and they were backing us throughout and we did get the win for them. And it was just a very happy feeling.